What's good? It's Chigozi. Wednesday, February 5th, 2020. We have more stock market numerical ritual. Casper Sleep Inc. Their IPO is officially a disaster because it's now priced lower than what they said it was. Making investors more wary of investing, which they are the ones who move the market, the big institutions, the you-know-whos, the Freemasons. So, you know, the Catholic Church. And investors, institutions, they typically like to invest in things over like $20, ideally even like $30. So if the price is below $20, especially, it makes investors not as cool with adding it to their funds, investing in it, what's et cetera. There's still going to be a lot of traders, but that's kind of a general rule. And that's why they put out this type of ritualistic propaganda about their stock. And first off, what's going to happen is that now that it's cheaper, I mean, this draws people like my interest. I like trading cheaper names. So this thing's going to IPO. I looked at the details, their S1 filings. I don't know how finalized this is, but they're talking about something along the lines of 36 million shares. But then they're valuing the company at 1.1 billion. So it's like the market cap going to be like a billion with 36 million shares, which is still not bad. Like the floats, not too low but it's not like it's high or anything like it's still in the range i like so i like how it'll trade the market cap's pretty high but i mean i'm sure this this gang can throw a few billion at it that day or at least a billion and double the price so what this video is just to quickly show you my i think i took too long to get into this but if you're still here is to show you that it's a very good example Casper equals 26 and 62. So you would think that this would come out tomorrow, February 6th, the 6th of February. But this then completely shows again. They love to use also the ticker symbol in the rituals. CSPR equals 52 and 25. When you reverse the optical order, reduce each letter to a single digit. Today is the 5th of February, February 5th. So we get Casper, then this was from the front page here at 540. I know some of you are thinking of Casper the Friendly Ghost. This is very well has some sort of riddle parallel to that. I'm not too sure. I didn't look too much into that part. You know, I don't, I don't even see much with the Camacho right now, but who knows? But what I just saw was the 25 symbolism that they're giving you this. The New York-based startup filed to go public earlier in January, on January 10th. On 10 slash 1, <laughs> Casper equals 26, 101 C 26 prime. And I'll show you on the official documents that the SEC, the United States Security Exchange Commission, who also practices this Kabbalah, they require these companies to do it. Look at this shit. Oh, I got to pause the video real quick. One second. One second. I had to answer a phone call. But you see here, this is the official documents. This is where we saw the 36 million shares. On September 9th, 2019, the company further authorized an increase of 1 million shares, bringing the total to 36 million of Series B common stock authorized. So this is not, you know, you, can't, you can only take this with a grain of salt, but I'm just trying to get a feel of what's going to happen when it IPOs. I'm going to trade it either with real or fake money, whatever you know I'm doing at the time. January 10th, 2020. See, this is when... See, as filed with the Securities and Exchange Commission on January 10th, 2020. Very clearly by the numbers. 101, that's the 26 prime number, Casper 26. You see how, they're, how the SEC and this company, Casper, are putting on this numerical rituals by the numbers. That was a date with 42 numerology, 51. That 51 date numerology is really interesting as well because today's news comes out five weeks and one day from when they release. Oh, that's January 1st, excuse me. Scratch that. But there's still a 51 here. Casper Sleep Inc. equals 233, the 51st prime. But let's redo this, because it's January 10th. 
January 10th, 2020. Till today, they're giving you this news. 27 days. Oh my God, it's 26 days without the end dates. Because they're seeing how Casper, that's why I couldn't even get the a perfect number. Because I was doing this earlier. I was like, okay, this could have been a little better. Look at this shit. 26 days from when they're filing this. Because this is official government documentation. So don't sit there and say it's a coincidence. It's, no, 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 no. This is exactly from the federal government, from this company, from Casper, from CSPR. It was in the media today on 2 slash 5 slash 5 slash 2. CSPR equals 52.25. Casper equals 26.62. So what do we get? We get on 10 slash 1, the 26 prime. 26 days later, they're on the front page CNN. Giving us this article published today. It's by the numbers. Every time I show you these stock market companies participate, it's always very clearly by the code. And what does that tell you? Again, if these people always do these rituals, that means that, that this company is bound to participate in some numerical ritual, some news by this same pattern in the new future. So if you have an option spread on, you maybe you can manage it when it's around a certain special date, maybe around May 2nd. Maybe May or June 2nd or something. Don't have a spread on. I don't know. Don't trade it or trade it and anticipate some sort of volatile event. It's up to you what to do with the information. It's, there's literally millions of things you can do with what I'm showing you here with the stock market. It's all about what your strategy is, et cetera, and what you do and how you like to trade. But I'm at least putting this in your face. They even give you the 216 video, a lot like 26, but 216 going back to the Kia David, you know, six times six times six, 26. Or excuse me, six times six times six is 216, not 26. But this is just unbelievable. 101, the 26 prime. These these people are Freemasons. This is how they put out the information. It is by a miracle system. And they put the unicorn parade. I wonder what that equals. Don't forget Casper Sleep Inc. equals 64, like Synagogue of Satan. Unicorn Parade, just Unicorn Parade, 13967, like Freemasonry. This is Freemasonry. So see right here, the NYSE, this is Freemasonry. The Freemasons, they own this com these computers. They built this place. This is where they trade the markets that they run, that they have enough money to do what they want with. They have enough control over the institutions, the banks, the rules to do what they want. The Unicorn Parade equals 260, a lot like 26. The numerology dropped to zero. Casper 26, the Unicorn Parade 26. It's 26 days from when they filed this S1 document, their IPO. From the SEC, dated here as perfectly stated in this official government from the document. And one more time, 101, I like 10 slash one, it's the 26 prime number. And that's a big banking number. That's, that's why they're doing this. Bank equals 26. Dollar equals 26. Remember the whole ritual where it took the Dow so long to try to cross 26,000 or whatever, and it couldn't for a while. It couldn't, and it sold back off before it eventually coming back up past it. Something that Zach was, was talking about for a while. And you're seeing how they're doing it here in this big banking ritual. Even talk about this 94 million. We saw that earlier. I don't think Casper equals 94. Something equals 94. I typed it in earlier. I think Unic Unicorn was 94, but I don't think I'm. I don't think they're trying to connect that. That might just be a piece I'm not sure of right now. But Sleep has this this gematria, so I'm, I'm keeping this in mind as well. I haven't seen much of this in their story, but definitely they'll use this pattern in these stories. The company got it started in April 2014. So we'll see. We'll see when it IPOs, the data happens, what's going to happen. It's going to be by the code. They even look. Look at their target share price now. They cut it from 17 to 19 to, to what? 12 to 13. What's 12 plus 13? 25. Today is 2 slash 5. CSPR 25, 
New World Order 75. They have the 705 million right here. You know, it's always by the same exact system. Maybe we can still see it on the front page. I can show you how it was, uh, it was on the front page. So you can see how I like to put these things in your face. Exxon steady decline. Exxon is the government. They're not going anywhere. If they ever actually go and decline, it'll just be some new thing from the same gang under a new brand coming out. Trump acquitted. I don't even want to get distracted by this stuff. I've already said my thing about this. It's, it's a play. I've been saying the whole time it's a play. You're being deceived. There was never any impeachment. It's fake. So yeah, Casper's IPO is officially a disaster. See what I'm saying? Right here on the front page. On this fitting date numerology by the number 26. IPO 22. Date with, it was 22, or excuse me, 2020. But, you know, there's been, there's IPOs all the time, you know. I, I can give them a pass on that one, I guess. Saying it was a disaster, 58, like Freemasonry. And that's exactly what it is. Freemasonry is a disaster that has hit this world, that has hit this nation especially. And it needs to be amended. What Trump's reality show speech revealed. Can you just understand what the federal government does to mock us? Every single time. What have I been saying since day one? Donald Trump is nothing else than a theatrical actor for the federal government. So what did he do? They had a State of the Union address and they have this whole impeachment thing. It gets acquitted and they're after. So he gets acquitted. So they give you the impeachment. It started one day and ends today, 134 days later, impeachment 134 and make America great again 134 when it started back in September. So they give you that. So right when it ends, what do they tell you? It's a reality show. Do you, do you understand the depth of mocking that the federal government, this one world order, Freemasonic order, does on a multiple time basis? All the time. Every single time they can. At 1242, Freemason 42, Zionism 42, Jesuit 42. It is the Freemasons, the Zionist Jews, the Jesuit order, crafting and concocting this fake news propaganda and mocking you in it. It's always that simple. Saturn 42, Donald Trump's an actor playing the role of Saturn Keeper of Time. Female 42, the impeachment inquiry when it started, like the the whole showdown. That was on a date with 42 numerology. The date that the Trump like literally got impeached or whatever. And Nancy Pelosi was like hailed a hero or whatever. I mean, come on, guys. Do I have to really... Like, I'm about to close this video. I really am. What's the point of continuing when I've met my goal again? I, we just showing you how the stock market's rigged. How the S I mean, look what the S&P 500 just did. I mean, look what... I mean, it's just ridiculous. This is exactly what I'm saying when I mean that they run the markets. It does not matter. The stuff doesn't matter. Like, all the news around it, most of the price action, at the end of the day, it doesn't matter. Because, I mean, come on, look at this shit. Like, they t always take it one way and then pump it. It made new highs today. It made new highs today after this type of dip. Saying the coronavirus, you know, there's a cure has been found or whatever. Some treatment's been found in America. So they give you a, a contrived virus, contrive a virus, might as well call it that. They put out all sorts of news about it. That's why all this happened. Look, this nice steady uptrend we've had. Well, I don't want to call it steady, but this uptrend we've had. This is the day of the coronavirus propaganda. More coronavirus propaganda comes out, all by the numbers. And then they say, oh, now our treatment's been found in America, or whatever. And now it's at the all time highs. This proves it. If the number, if the news is fake, all by the numbers, all contrived, and the market is absolutely following it to the letter to do some shit like this. I mean, look how it bounced off the lows. Gaps up, gaps up, gaps up. And who knows? We'll get hired. I even said, guys, these people can take this thing as high as they want. Don't be surprised to take your shit to 350, 400, 500, 600. They're pumping Tesla now. They probably give you the sign. They give you the signal to say, yes, we can pump any fucking shit we want. We have all the fucking money. We have all the fucking power. We are the Freemasons. Pump and dump. Haven't I not called Tesla pump and dump since day one? This is absolutely a fucking pump and dump. This is no different than a penny stock chart. This is no different than fucking Bitcoin. This is the type of bullshit that the Freemasons, the federal government, likes to put on and all the time.
So without getting too sidetracked, and I'll definitely make more videos explaining this type of theatrics. I mean, look at this. Unbelievable. Tesla. Insane. Goes from what? <laughs> Just look at this breakout spot at you know, like 350 to 1,000 <laughs> in like a couple of months. I mean, it's like 960-something, but you know, you can, you can round up to 1,000. And they're calling it a reality show. I mean, this you see what you're living out. It's a scripted reality series, a TV series. The market's rigged and scripted. Your politics are rigged, rigged and scripted. Elon Musk is just a theatrical actor. Donald Trump is just a theatrical actor. Mark Zuckerberg is just a theatrical actor for the Freemasons. The Zionist Jews, the Jesuit Order. This is how they concocted Paul's stuff out by the code. Peace out.